walking beside them. Now I'm home. Yes, I'm walking beside them. Walking beside. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, <laughs> that was a good shot. Local locas, I'm Crystal. I'm Allie. And we are at Pizzeria Vesuvio. Oh. Hopefully we set that right. We're gonna interview the, the owner, so hopefully we don't butcher it. <laughs> We're gonna get some behind the scenes um, in the truck. This is located on Alamo Street, right across the street from Friendly Liberty Spot. Bar, Liberty Bar and yeah. Friendly Spot, around that area. In the south town area of San Antonio. We just got a menu right now. You're gonna get some footage right now of what it looks like and what they have to offer. Um, they have someone singing outside. It's really popping right now because today is a Friday, Friday. night. So yes. it's- Friday, everybody got paid. Everybody's gonna get pizza. Yes, I'm and they excited. have pasta. And wine. And wine. <laughs> Are we getting wine? I don't know. I say we get wine. Okay, let's have wine. We might get wine. <laughs> Try some new stuff and come in and take a look. Hi, I'm Crystal. Nice to meet you. I'm Tony Anthony Rodriguez. I go by Tony. My name is Anna and I am the pastry chef at the City of Vesuvio. I also in charge of the pastas and salads. You know, I do all the desserts and all the truck. And and also, well, I also help a little bit with the pizzas. My name is Esteban. I'm one of the owners of Pizzeria Vesuvio. Two people about wine and how pair wine with food and all this. Where did y'all get the name from? Ah, uh, okay. So the first time we worked in the truck was super hot because the, the air conditioners just weren't keeping it cool enough. So hot, it's like a volcano. And I'm like, oh, a volcano. Perfect! Oh my god! We should name it like a famous volcano, Vesuvio. Oh. Famous Italian volcano. And so, I mean, it, it worked out perfectly because that's kind of the style of pizza. We were doing more Italian style pizza. How long have y'all been here? Uh, at this location, um, almost exactly two years, almost to the day. Uh, we originally opened at a different location. It was a little further from the, the main King Williams kind of area. In this neighborhood that we've been serving for about 15 years now. When we got an opportunity to come here, we jumped at that chance, and uh, we've been here ever since. There's no plans to move. We're a family here. We we work together for a really long time. Time the pizza, right? I really like the Alfredo pasta. The Alfredo sauce is very good. Personal favorite is the Genovese. It's a pesto pizza with chicken, and I just feel like it's kind of different from the standard tomato sauce variety pizza. It's a good change it up kind of pizza. My favorite dish is pasta. Um, I, I really enjoy sugar rosa sauce. Sugar rosa sauce is the, is the combination between Bianco sauce and uh, Pomodoro sauce. It looks pink. I really like that a lot. And then the other really popular one is the King Williams, my other favorite. We uh, twirl the crust and roll it in a circle so it looks like a crown. And then we season it and it comes with some marinara to dip it in. What is your favorite pastry to make over here? Wow. Probably the tiramisu. A lot of people love it. Very authentic is my, my own recipe, so it's different. It has a, like a secret flair. I like to put this uh, this uh, grains of coffee that uh, covering white chocolate on top, and I think that gives it a little extra. And then something that I haven't seen anywhere else is the tartufo. We made that with uh, gelato. It has chocolate gelato. It has a brandy chair in the middle. So we made these little bowls of gelato. And, and then we cover it with cookie crumbles. And then I put like a little bit of, of chocolate on top. And a strawberry. It's really good. All right. Drum roll. Delicious. Really? Mm -hmm. You gotta get like the pasta, the chicken, the cheese. Oh my god, it's like super creamy. 
like really good. I have a pork in my hand. Oh no! Oh my god! I have to have to have to try that. The rigatoni? No, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. The rigatoni? Rigatoni, Alfredo, and uh, chicken. We'll put it like somewhere right here. What yeah. we ordered. Everything that we ordered, we kind of just went on the fly. And then they recommended everything that we ordered. So, so like luck is, was on our side ordering. Yeah. This like, is recommendation right yeah. here. Like of course the wine was recommended, but like Crystal always gets the red wine. I always get like the white wine, the sweet wine. Pizza has pesto, chicken, basil, basil um, mozzarella. Mm -hmm. They're located in the Southtown area, which is always popping. Yeah, um, especially on Friday, yes. first Friday. I'm this always is to like die for. It's delicious. Even like on a lunch break, if you're nearby, um, in the area of Southtown, you have to get this. It's so good. The chicken is just like huge. huge. Like huge. they give you a big old chicken. Not like Olive Garden. And I mean, you heard them like when we were asking the question. Everything is like homemade, homegrown to you. And they use their family recipes. Yes. Uh, Ms. Anna said that she was using her own secret recipes. So two for two for desserts. All the places we filmed so far, when it comes to food, I would definitely 1,000% recommend coming. Oh, okay, mom. Coming <laughs> to Pizzeria Vestudio. It's very family friendly. They have a very spacious outdoor patio. I mean, it's outside. They had like an AC unit in front of us. In the front, they have the live music. It's just a great atmosphere. It's very homey. It's very yes, welcoming. Yes, super welcoming and homey. Check out Pizzeria Vesuvio. Get everything we got. Mm -hmm. Tell Including Tony the wine. And Esteban and Anna. Hi for us. They were very welcoming and very yeah, welcoming. Yeah, and it was a very busy Friday night when we got here. But they took their time to interview. They took their time to talk about their business, where they got the name from, recommendations. So thank you to them for letting us film here. If you made it at the end of this video, like and subscribe and hit that notification button so that way you can see whenever we have another video posted. Also give us a follow on all our platforms. We're on YouTube, uh, Instagram, and TikTok. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>